Smell of the creation. Mickey Fitz and Ray the Ref having a bit of an issue here. It is a new disqualification for way high stakes match. As you heard earlier, each of the participants have put something on the line. In Gallagher's gold, Cyanide's number one contendership status. This is the one we've all been waiting for. Main event of the evening. All on the line. High stakes. No disqualification. Grand Pro Wrestling heavyweight title. We saw it only the strong survive. All four men make the claim. Jack Gallagher, the man about to make his entrance. Undefeated in 2012. Has instigated his own title. Gallagher's gold, here he is. It is the fourth lane wonder. Hogan, the only gold that really matters. The only gold with any integrity left in all sports. You think the World Cup? No, that's been discredited long ago. Brazil are after Gallagher's gold. Nothing else makes, makes any difference. A guy who's going to unify the GPW title, unify the World Cup, unify the America's Cup. He's taking them all. He's to this no disqualification for a world match. The undefeated Jack Gallagher puts on Jack Gallagher's gold on the line. The number one contender, the official number one contender, wants to cash in his truck. He puts it on the line. It's fine, I guess, King. He's no longer the number one contender. What? What? If he comes out of this match either victorious or not getting pinched, he's still the number one contender. Uh, Triple H is put a bit of an insurance policy with him. He's rocking that folding chair. He's going to need something to sit on while the match is on. You were saying before in that Jack Gallagher, Gallagher's goal, is ready to tackle with integrity. I think it shows how much the GPW title is actually means. I think it shows how much that title actually means to everyone that he's willing to put that on the line to be in this match. I know he's talking about merging the titles, but you tell me if Jack Gallagher wins tonight, is he going to go home and polish up his own title? Or is it going to be the GPW title? The title has been held by Jerry Fielder twice, by Dangerous Taylor Lee, by Bubbles, people of the great caliber. It's Jack Gallagher, wants to be by Chris Hero Wilson. This is the career that Jack Gallagher won. Winning the GPW heavyweight title tonight would put Jack Gallagher on the map as Britain's premier wrestler. Jack Gallagher may look like Gallagher's gold, but Dirk Feelgood has got the most at stake tonight. Dirk Feelgood, as you're saying, it's history or end. Career defining. Potentially career ending. Dirk Feelgood put his career on the line for one last goal. If he pins tonight, that's it. He's gone. He can obviously keep his career as long as he doesn't lose. And, and you can bet your last dollar that Dirk Fieldwood will be given everything tonight just so he cannot risk losing everything that he holds precious to. Losing the master plan. Not be gaining for the first time the GPW heavyweight title. Never coming back. The wrestle, they feel good. Dude, he's got a lot, a lot on the line. My goodness, the exact opposite. He's got it all to lose. That's what you get when you're the champ. You got to put it up. And my goodness, he's been doing that. But this is his biggest, biggest challenge today. Sam Shaw, bring it in. Weighing in tonight at 
with 350 pounds whilst carrying another man who weighs 206 pounds. There, there is no stopping Cyanide. You call him the walking condominium. I just call him a beast. The man is like nothing we've ever seen before in GPW. I have taken, I, I partook in the Cyanide Slam Challenge. I have been there to some extent. In the grip of Cyanide. And let me tell you, I tapped. I was, I was down for the count. And I expect everybody else in the world to be the same. The guy is huge. Kirby, Cyanide in the ring. The intriguing thing is, if either of these men pinned the other, it would leave them being both the champ and the number one contender. I don't know whether that, how that would work, whether they would be able to name their own next opponent. It'd make an interesting August anyway. If it wasn't interesting enough, the Robbie Brooks side in town. But Jack Gallia has got to focus on the two men in the ring and the other one who's lying around somewhere near the ring, first of all. Cyanide pushes off. Jack Gallagher. Gallagher with a drop kick to the head. Cyanide to the outside. Obviously, we heard before announced Roddy Brookside versus Jack Gallagher with in front of, from Wigan with Love, August the 24th, 2012. That match could be for the GPW title here. What a match that would be. I think you mean the unified title, unified with Gallagher's gold. The greatest prize the sport has ever seen. Kirby fails with the back elbow, Gallagher picks him up and drops him right on his head. Vicious back suplex and I thought the title was gone there. Ray the ref wasn't counting the pin, he was counting the vertebrae left in my Kirby's back. Feel good gets the rep to the pin, trying to win this precious title. Cyanide signaling perhaps it's over, off the ropes, not for the big splash. Kirby just about gets out of the way. New ring, please. Bill Gunn and Gallagher working together, maybe looking for the suplex. Struggling to get the big man off. And perhaps it's Cyanide. No, it's Cyanide. Is Cyanide going to go all the way on his own? Incredible. Two man suplex by the big man. The crowd might not like Cyanide. The crowd might not like Alan Tasker, but they like what they see. They're chanting GPW. Kirby off the top rope with the back elbow. That's the lever, that's the champ again. He's got to be sure at all times. He can't sleep. He can't take a breath. Because anytime anyone gets pinned, he's losing that title. The, the, the possibilities are endless tonight, Ian. Do we see the title merge? With Gallagher's gold, do we see Cyanide getting his first heavyweight title award? Do we see Jeff Fieldgood getting the, to become the first bit of a springboard somersault dropped by Kirby to the outside, takes out everyone. That's what he's got to do. If he wants to keep the title, he's got to make sure that nobody is capable of getting the pin. And right now, He's doing an admirable job of that, he's a fighting champion. As I said, Jack Fieldgood, historic, first ever, three-time GPW champion. That's what we could be hearing tonight. But what else we could be hearing is Jack, Jack Gallagher has lost his own goal. We could be hearing that Cyanide is no longer the official number one contender. Flying crossbody by Kirby, but most importantly of all, you could be healing. Jake Feelgood has gone. Jake Feelgood must retire. There's a high stakes match, and the crowd here, don't they know it? This place is hot. It's got that big fight atmosphere. Kirby skips through. Comes up with the neck breaker. Feelgood down. One, two, is it? And Feelgood, he can see the Qatar's hand coming down. Every inch it got closer to the ground was an inch closer to Fieldgood's career being over. He had it flash before his eyes and then he saw that bit where he was getting pinned by Martin Kirby and he kicked out. He's still going and he's going to be history making champ unless Jack Gallagher has a word to Back say. Back elbow! Oh, oh, oh. elbow by Gallagher! Cover! Oh, oh. I, thought that was, I thought that was it. A real fuck elbow replied. That could be it. Middle of the ring, no DQ. Will 
Jack Carlin has a point. Will Kirby top out Cyanide notices. Comes into the ring, ducks the clothesline. Gallagher to the second rope. Gets in the headlock. He's got a guillotine. He's trying to get it locked in. Jack Gallagher knows his way around the hole, but Cyanide oh! launches him off. Throws him six, seven feet in the air. Gallagher comes down on his chest. Whatever it is, feel good, felt it almost as much. And that's what's on the line, you've got to give it all. Double DDT on the champ, on Gallagher. That's your time, feel good, everyone's down. He's on top, everyone is down. He's making history, he's making history for the master plan. Oh, he's going for the double pin. A double feel, feel good four. Feel good four. Two times over. He's taking the gold. He's taking most of the gold. He's doing it all. Both the master down. plan. Yes. Both yes. If they tap. If they tap. Both. Feel good. Has his career. Feel good. Has the championship. And feel good. Has Gallagher's gold. Yes. You're begging for it. And I know you looked at it. I know you can't yes. imagine yes. his career being over. Saying I can see. Slipping away! A big splash! Ends that big double feel good for Cyanide. Tosses Gallagher into the corner. It's one thing they'll break your concentration during a submission hold. It's Cyanide jumping on top of you. Big breaker! And Ash backbreaker by Cyanide. Seven over two. And the champ kicks out Martin Kirby. I've spoken to him about what that belt means to him and he says it is a justification for everything that he's given up his entire career. It's no DQ, we've got a chair in the ring. That's just what Alan Tesco is sitting on, he may as well get him off and out. Alright, oh, Sinai's having a sit down, he's tired. No DQ Ian, oh, you know what I mean, I prefer a legitimate real wrestling match. But when it's no DQ, anything goes. When the stakes are this high, you can't afford a technicality. Like a disqualification to get in the way. It's got to be decisive. And Cyanide's about to put a full stop on this thing. And we may be looking at a choke slam onto the chair. And Kirby catches him, drops the elbows on the head. Cyanide is staggered. Feel good. A kick to the Cojones. Eye. Suplex onto Cyanide's arms. No, Jack, no. Oh! Beautiful win. Beautiful combination. Team Fieldgood and Cyanide. But they're not friends for long. Clothesline drops Fieldgood. Cyanide feeling that kick to the stones. You can't make a pack with Cyanide for more than about 20 seconds before I realize this that he wants to eat you and kill you. And that's what happens right now! Kirby! Dreamland! Dreamland onto the chair! Is Sinai gonna lose on the one contendership? Feel good. Feel good looking to roll over. Maybe feel good looking to cover the big man. Doesn't matter, as we've said Ian, it doesn't matter who you pin. Whoever you pin, you win the gold. But it's what the other person loses. It's what the other person loses if they're pinned. Sinai can see his number one contendership slipping away. He hasn't moved since that dreamland. Trading punches between Feelgood and Kirby. A forearm to the face of Feelgood. The punch to the face for Kirby. Another forearm. And again. And again. Feelgood is rocking. Kirby firing up. But the knee to the midsection stops it. I knew it was going to be his one! 
I'm not ready to come to terms with that, Dave. We can hook it out later on, you, you don't need to worry. An ovation for Dirk Fielder at the end, thoroughly deserved for a man who has gave his all for this company, was willing to put everything he had on the line, and it just wasn't enough tonight. That was this was being Battlefield 2. Thanks for coming out, keeping the scene alive!